Hey guys, my name is Freedom. Today I'm going to show you the basic navigation and GUI graphic user interface in LeoCAD. And I will show you how to create some basic modeling as well and the basic operations like move, like rotate in LeoCAD. LeoCAD is a totally free software that can allow you to build any of the LEGO models. So now I already opened the LeoCAD. You can see now I use I use my mouse mouse to scroll. You can zoom in and zoom out. And then here you can see the bricks. You have different types of the bricks where allow you to change the color as well. Allow you to change the color. Change the color first and then you drag it out. Now you can have different colors. create any of the Lego models. Now you can see in order to rotate the preview camera, you have to hold the alternate key. Hold the alternate and use your mouse. Use your mouse, mouse left click to rotate. All right. Let's say if I select this, I hold the alternate and then use my mouse left click, drag my mouse left click, then I can rotate by using using the selected object as the axis. Let's say if I select this, I hold the alternate and use the left click to drag and rotate, the axis will be here. Alright, so now if I want to move the preview camera, I, I have to hold the alternate and use the mouse middle button to drag. Right. Use the mouse middle button to drag. Rotate, drag. So if you want to select, you have to release any keyboard key and just use, use your mouse left click to drag and select then you can move it so because of this is this is the lego bricks lego models that available in leocad if i want to put something for example i want to put this brick at here you can see it is it automatic will fit to there So maybe I want some base plates. I, I select the color that I want. Say here. Sorry, where is it? Okay, now I have a base plate. If I want to put some bricks on there, I can just put some bricks. Let's say this one. put onto that and then you can drag it actually you can put it anywhere of course you better fit to the fit to the brick to make it look natural but actually you can put it anywhere just to select it and use the gizmo See, this one, if I want to move it, I can just move it. At the same time, actually, I can rotate it as well. You can see a rotation. You can rotate to certain angle. Actually, you have you have so much freedom to rotate it. It won't just limit to the, to the Lego brick. You can put it anywhere. Right. So after you create a model, 
usually after you create a model, you want to export the whole thing, the whole scene or the whole models as as a 3D files. You will just click here, file, export. You can export as, as a Coleda. This is DAE file or you can export it as WaveFront. WaveFront is OBJ file. All right, I try the WaveFront. I will export on my desktop. I can create a, a new file name. I save it. Now you can see the OBJ file is here. If I double click it, double click the OBJ file, it will open with the 3D viewer. Now you can see it is a complete 3D model that you can drag this OBJ file into any into any of the 3D software like Unreal Engine, iClone, Blender, anything. So this LeoCAD, it is really useful and for today's tutorial, I already finished introduce you all the, the basic navigations, the basic modeling, rotations, move, and apply bricks. And that's all for today. Thank you for watching. If you love my video tutorial, if you feel all these tutorials are very helpful to your 3D animation and game developing and 3D modeling, you can subscribe to my YouTube channel and also turn on the mini bell and select all to activate the notification so that when next time I publish a new video tutorial, you receive the notification immediately. See you in my next video. Enjoy. Happy animation and game developing. See you.